everybody, welcome back to another video with Electra Soul. If you're new to my channel, I'm a psychic medium, a spiritual life coach, and just a spiritual bitch putting everybody on. What I intend to do is to teach people that God and Jesus and the universe coexist as one. Now today in this video, guys, this video is going to be about simply talking to yourself whenever you're in doubt, especially if you're a law of assumptioner, which obviously this video is for. If you are using the law of assumption, I promise you, you are somebody who wants the best for yourself because you know that being a conscious manifester is all about getting what it is that you want out of this lifetime because you know that you can because you know that you're strong enough to because you know that you're on top of your shit enough to get what you want by simply affirming and persisting within having what you want but obviously while we're on our manifestation journey especially if you are a beginner to using the law of assumption you obviously know that there are moments in which you experience having doubt in which you feel like you can't get what you want it's not possible well, all the bullshit that really does not align with you nor does it exist because you said so and that's it but most definitely i can completely understand in which people feel doubt because i know that for me personally speaking i used to be extremely doubtful even while using the law at the start I used to think that not that it was bullshit but just that it wasn't gonna happen for me I just figured that I was the one who was excluded and all that bullshit had a lot of doubts but then I realized over time that simply sitting down with yourself and talking to yourself like you would talk to your best friend or talk to someone who's really in doubt is really all that you need to get you right back on track and so with that being said guys today in this video what I'm going to be covering is how you should be talking to yourself whenever you're in doubt to simply re-get yourself right back on track in the most simple way possible because at the end of the day I feel feel like this is really overlooked like I feel like people when they start reacting they don't really think like let me sit down and just refocus myself let me just think about this real quick I feel like people just react emotionally very quickly just upset whatever because I know that I used to be like that anytime that I would get upset I would just think 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 and just go in all the way and at the end I would feel even worse than if I would have just sat there and just be like girl what the hell are you talking about you feel me but then anyway like, before we get deeper into this let's get started with the video right now so that we can get to talking about speaking to yourself kindly whenever you're in doubt to re-get yourself right back on track i guess you could say it's like a little technique i don't know it's just like a life tool that you can use in general while using the law of assumption because you know again if you are a conscious manifester you are 10 times out of 10 affirming for literally every single thing within your reality not letting anything just slip by be however it wants to be whatever because you know that you can do this but then anyway upon us being conscious manifestors it is very important to realize that we are the ones who are in control of our entire realities whether you believe it or not whether you think that you can manifest something or not not, I promise you, you can fucking manifest it. There is a possibility and a reality and a dimension in which every single thing that you want exists for you. Every single thing that you want here is already real. It's already done. Like there's nothing that you have to worry or wonder about and you don't have to doubt anything because you already know that it's done. And I mean this wholeheartedly because yes, I do get as well that a lot of people don't really believe it until they see it. And I honestly am one of those people as well. I don't really believe shit until I fucking see it. At least I don't believe it 110%, but I will say that I have seen a lot of shit. I mean, everything. I literally have seen everything in my life change and in other people's lives change because we have used the law of assumption to our advantage. And honestly, you can definitely see the same thing for the other side. You know, all the negative shit. You literally see that shit being reflected within people's lives because what do truthfully like a lot of people in this world do? They talk shit. They talk bad about themselves. They talk bad about the world. They talk bad about this, that, whatever. And then what does that do? It makes it manifest for themselves, which is why those who are really negative usually have really negative lives too. But in this case, like in our case, we're very positive. Positive. we're very strong we know that we can do this and so that's why our lives are reflected within the energy of us being that way because we are thinking from that perspective okay so upon us knowing this like upon us knowing the fact that everything in this reality can shift change whatever it is into the way that you want it to be simply because like literally just because you said so and think about it or whatever and that's it just because you said so though it all manifests for you but you know like I said you do experience doubt at times I'm sure not you but like the other people who need to understand that doubt is not anything that can actually affect you nor is it real but yes you might experience doubt in life you might experience doubt while using the law of assumption you might think that parts of it are bullshit or maybe that not all things manifest for you or whatever you know a lot of people be talking but I'm gonna tell y'all that the only thing that you have to do whenever you get to a point where you feel like you're in doubt like maybe you want to manifest that your dog's leg is magically not broken anymore or whatever you're going to visualize that but you're gonna be like how is that physically possible like how can that really really occur like can my dog's leg really not be broken I'm gonna tell y'all right now that even though you are in doubt about and even though you might think like how is that real how is that possible can this really happen for me whatever it is I need y'all to understand that yes of course it's real yes of course it can happen and yes the only thing that's holding you back is you so that's why you have to stop thinking from the perspective that it can't work out that it's not possible blah 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 whatever it is that you're thinking about in regards to this because telling yourself and affirming to yourself that not everything is possible and that it's just too unrealistic and just cancel it out fucking forget it let's just go to the vet whatever and obviously you should take them to the vet but that's besides the point all I'm trying to say is that before 
before you start doubting yourself, just take a fucking moment to sit back and to talk to yourself about what it is that you're doubting so hard. Sit down with yourself and just think to yourself, there are people out here who have manifested millions of dollars. There are people out here who have manifested perfect health. There are people out here who have manifested everything that they want and I'm the only one sitting here telling myself that I can't have it. What am I doing? Okay, right then and there. That's literally for some people all that they need in order to get them right back on track. Sometimes all they have to do is just sit down for a second and I think that this is more so for people who just need a quick reminder but you sit down there for a second and you just talk to yourself you're like girl like why are you so in doubt like why do you think that it can't happen what the fuck are you talking about bro just talk to yourself for a fucking second just chill the fuck out and sit down and just talk just speak stop rambling on stop going off in your mind stop telling yourself that it's not possible stop telling yourself that it's ridiculous to even dream about because what are you doing you're completely ignoring everything that your soul naturally knows which is the fact that you can and will have everything that you want and instead you are counter-attacking that shit by telling yourself it can't happen it's not gonna happen blah blah it's not possible like shut the fuck up sorry but be quiet just be quiet for a second because again like i said i was one of these people you know i would go off and off and off and off and off and i would talk to my boyfriend and be like bro like this shit is not real how the fuck is it gonna happen just go off and off and off and just keep talking talking but it was like just sit down and fucking relax you know in the moment that i'd be like bro i don't think it's gonna happen my boyfriend would be like did you ever think about the fact that it could that it would if you said so and that's it and after that i was like damn <laughs> yeah you're fucking right that's completely right i just need to remind myself of that do you see what i'm saying you just need to remind yourself that everything in this world is possible to manifest that you can have do be whatever you want to be that there's no reason as to why you sitting there telling yourself that well it's not blah, blah, all that bullshit that that actually has to matter or mean anything within your reality because it absolutely doesn't and truth be told it's like adding fire to the flame or fuel to the flame or whatever the fuck because you're only making things way worse than they have to be you're only making things more escalated than they have to be you're making your number two into a number three you don't want to deal with that shit no pun intended but for real you don't want to deal with that you don't want to make it harder for yourself to literally sit there and just affirm within the fact that you have what you want instead of talking so much shit do you understand sometimes we ourselves don't even realize that we just need a simple reminder to let us know that everything is still possible there have been times where i myself would go off on a rampage for like two fucking weeks and i'd be like it just wasn't gonna happen it's not real it just really wasn't gonna happen and then at the end guess what happened i would see somebody else manifest that thing and i'd be like how the fuck did they do that how did they manifest that thing and then you want to know what i would do after that i would sit there and i'd be like wait a minute they manifested what they wanted because they affirmed for it because they believed it because they knew that they fucking could do you understand that was the only thing that i was missing was me going on strong within the fact that i have what i want because instead of doing that i just decided to talk shit rampage inside of my mind just don't even reason with it just fucking forget it no that did not help me what helped me was me sitting there and being like wait this girl manifested it for herself if she could then i can too what's the difference there's no difference everything in this reality is possible to manifest i can do this if she can do it why can't i bro that was literally all that it needed to put me right back on track to remind me of what i'm doing to myself the only thing that i was doing to myself during these times was just making it harder for myself to understand and to believe the fact that i can really do this you know i was just talking so much shit just going off what you tell me is not gonna matter at all but instead all i had to do was just sit down and just reason it out for myself just open my mind up to the fact that everything in this world is possible to have because even then at the time i genuinely believed that everyone in their mom could manifest what it is that they wanted but I felt that I was the excluded one and that's why sometimes you just need to take a breather and you just gotta be like girl why are you so hard on yourself like you are perfect just as you are if you want something done it's gonna be done there's nothing for you to worry or wonder about you need to talk to yourself like you would talk to your child to your dog to your best friend whoever needs the comfort though you need to speak to yourself in the loving way that you deserve because there's no reason as to why you have to be so mean to yourself because of what you believe in that moment in that that moment where you're feeling upset super emotion filled but absolutely not you are not someone who reacts emotionally you are not someone who does not believe that you can do this because you're the excluded one because you're the victim you are not someone who believes that you cannot manifest what it is that you want because you are someone who does believe that you can manifest what you want you believe that you can do anything that you want you can believe that you are on top of your shit at all times because you absolutely are and that's it there is no other way shape and form around this you have to sit back talk to yourself like you would be talking to that child who cannot get over the fact that another kid stole their lollipop and just tell yourself to fucking relax and that everything is gonna be fine that you can still do this that you can still affirm for what it is that you want and you can still fucking get it do y'all understand what i'm saying it is literally the most simple step possible that we overlook 
We overanalyze. We overthink. Bro, chill the fuck out. Stop doubting so hard and instead just talk to yourself like you would be talking to somebody that you want to understand that everything is completely fine. You want to calm somebody down? Calm them down, but calm yourself down too. You should not be feeling so out of place, so out of touch, so unbelonging because you do belong here. I promise you, you do. But you need to keep up with it. You need to keep going on strong. Anytime that you feel like you're about to say some shit that you don't mean inside of your mind, just sit back, babe. Just take a breath. Like, deadass, take a breath. Speak to yourself. Just be like, baby girl, relax. You can do this. You can fucking do this. Just like, I can do this. I can fucking do this. I got this shit in the bag. I want what I want. I got it. I got it. Everything in my reality works out the way that I want it to simply because I said so. And that's it. Boom. Sometimes that's just all that you need. Sometimes taking two seconds out of your day to sit back and to just be like, girl, refucking lax is the perfect antidote that you need in that moment. I think I said antidote, right? Fuck. I don't know if I did, but the perfect recipe to get you over all the bullshit that you may have been freaking out about in that moment. Just speak to yourself in the most calming, nicest, relaxing way and remind yourself that you can do this, that you're on top of your shit because sometimes all you need is just a simple reminder, babe. And I know this for sure because I need reminders, babe. I need fucking reminders. I'd be reminding myself every day. I'm like, girl, just relax. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's completely fine. Boom. And then just like that, I go right back into the notion of where I was feeling, you know, feeling like I'm that bitch, feeling like I'm the main character, whatever. I could do this because I can, because you can, because we all fucking can, but you got to know it for yourself. You know, you cannot be beating yourself down when you're already down. Instead of beating yourself down, uplift yourself. That's someone pulling another hand's person up. Like literally lift yourself up and just be like, bro, it's okay. Instead of kicking that bitch down while you're already down, there's no point in doing that to yourself because you want the best for yourself. So you have to affirm within the fact that you already have the best for yourself and not allow yourself to contradict those beliefs because the beliefs that you're saying in which you have everything that you want is exactly what you want to see. So keep telling yourself that you do because you absolutely do. You are the one who's going to either uplift yourself or bring yourself down. Choose to uplift yourself because you deserve that, because you deserve the best out of this reality and because you deserve to believe that you can manifest every single fucking thing within this reality if you wanted to simply because you deserve it and that's it because I fucking said so and that's it. Do this for yourself my love and I promise you you will not regret it. You will not think it's a waste of time. You will simply see how much it will help you in two seconds. Two seconds. It takes two fucking seconds and even if it takes five minutes let it take five minutes whatever makes you feel the best inside of yourself because you can fucking do this and that's it y'all all right then do it because there's no reason as to why you have to be making it harder for yourself than it has to be when it doesn't have to be that way well then anyway my love that's basically it for my video thank y'all so much for watching i really appreciate it i intend that this video helped you to the best of its ability and i know that it did because guys listen to me once more you know talking down on yourself is something that is a very common theme i think within this society within this world you know people think it's cute to be mean to yourself and even though it's really fucking not cute at all i'm gonna need y'all to take the initiative and the extra step to really speak to yourself like that kid who's upset about the lollipop like really remind yourself that fuck that lollipop because you got unlimited lollipops because you got all the lollipops in the world because you can fucking do this because you know that you can because you're on top of your shit because you know that you are the creator the main character the one who's in control of your reality so how in the world would you fail how in the world could you not get what you want the only way is if you say that you can't do you understand if you sit here and you continue telling yourself that you're not going to get what you want it's not going to happen blah, blah blah forget about it all the doubts pretty much like if you keep repeating that to yourself obviously you're never going to feel good about yourself number one but number two you're never going to feel like you can manifest what it is that you want but it's not even just about feeling it because feeling does not get you what you want within the law of assumption what gets you what you want are the thoughts that you're saying to yourself but if you're feeling like shit all the time you're probably going to be saying really shitty things to yourself within your mind and all those shitty things that you're saying to yourself you don't want to see reflected within your 3d reality even if you think in that moment that you deserve it, I promise you, no the fuck you don't. And you wanna know how you're gonna realize that you don't? You're gonna realize you don't by you sitting down with yourself to tell yourself you don't deserve this. You don't belong here. This shit does not belong to you. All the good shit is what belongs to you. You gotta keep on going strong. You gotta know that this is meant for you. You gotta know that you can do this. You gotta remind yourself that you can do this because if you don't remind yourself, who the fuck is gonna remind you? I promise you, no one and their mama is gonna be sitting here each and every single day waiting for you to be upset so that they can cheer you up. And no, it's not about you waiting for yourself to be upset because you shouldn't even be looking forward to being upset like you shouldn't even expect to be feeling upset at all within your reality because you can't but all i'm saying is that if you experience moments in which you feel like oh i can't do this i don't know i feel a little bit of doubt i'm not too sure blah blah, blah that you sit down with yourself and you remind yourself of what you're doing this for it's all for fucking you nobody else but you you know that you can do this you know that you're the strongest person within your reality you single-handedly know that your thoughts manifest everything that you want within your reality and so how can you sit there and literally be mean to yourself on purpose when you could just be taking a step back sitting your ass down on your bed and being like baby girl relax relax everything is fine because i do it for myself whenever i feel this feeling if 
if I ever do, I sit on my bed or wherever I'm at and I'm just like, okay, before I say anything that I'm gonna regret, let's talk about this to myself. And then after you're done talking about it with yourself, you are going to see how you feel so much better because your soul is gonna be peering through. Your soul is gonna be coming through to let you know, babe, like what the fuck are you stressing out about? Your fears are trying to get a hold of you. Don't let them get a hold of you. And then boom, you're right back on track because you realize that you're not going to let yourself falter with your ego by listening to what your ego has to tell you because what your ego is telling you is not fucking relevant in any way, shape or form. You deserve the best for yourself. You deserve everything that you want. You deserve the entire world, but you already knew that. Now, sometimes you gotta remind yourself that you already knew that. So remind yourself, don't be afraid. Don't think that you failed. Don't think that you're bringing it back a step because I have to remind myself again. Oh my God, I thought I already knew this, bitch. I don't fucking care. Everyone needs a reminder sometimes, okay? It's completely okay to remind yourself. You feel me? Like there's nothing wrong with it. You're just reminding yourself of what your soul already knows. And then boom, your mind picks up on it and you're right back on track. Two seconds it takes instead of spiraling into all the bullshit that you never wanted to associate yourself with in the first place. Do you actually see how simple this is? Like, do you actually fucking see how simple it is? If you choose to not sit there and to talk to yourself right back into where you were, that is a choice that you're making for yourself. I have no pity for you. I don't feel bad at all. Like you're literally fucking doing it to yourself. So you got to choose to sit there and to be a fucking hard ass to yourself and to put yourself right back on track because you know that you deserve nothing less than that. You really don't. You deserve everything else that you want. You deserve the entire world. So allow yourself to have all that shit. Remind yourself that you do have all that shit. Remind yourself of your worth, of your power, of who you are and get right back on track. That's all you need to do. Look in the mirror if you have to. Talk to yourself on your bed. Talk to yourself out loud. I don't fucking care what you do, but remind yourself because you know that you can fucking do this and you got to tell yourself constantly that you can because you know that you can and that's it because nothing in this world can affect you nothing in this world can phase you you got the shit in the back for a reason it's because you're that bitch so allow yourself to be that bitch because you are meant to be that bitch and nothing less than that simply because you said so and that's it all right y'all i will see y'all this monday for another video thank y'all so much again for watching god bless y'all please take care everybody and really remind yourself babe like who the fuck is gonna uplift you if you're not doing it for yourself first you have to understand that you alone are the most powerful person within your reality you could do everything that you want to do if you wanted to and that's it so you have to understand that even during the moments in which you feel doubt which you never do duh that instead of going along with these doubtful thoughts and all that stuff that make you feel like you're less you got to sit down with yourself and just remind yourself calmly really quick I am that bitch I can do this I'm the main character I'm in control duh I'm fine and you're completely right you are fine you're that bitch you're the baddest bitch in fact you got to keep reminding yourself whenever you need the reminder and not feel shame for it just remind yourself and know that that will be more than enough to get you right back to where you needed to be which is where you never left bitch you were always there but just remind yourself because you deserve that for yourself you deserve to feel peace so allow yourself to feel this way because you deserve nothing less than best simply because we said so and that's it all right y'all perfect that's how it works so sit with that and remind yourself when you need it bye you want to know what's actually an l being a bitch to yourself instead of talking up to yourself because you need it in that moment bro literally why are you wasting your time sitting here being so rude to yourself because you feel like you can't do it when in reality of course you can like how can you decide that for yourself when you're supposed to be deciding only the best things for yourself you got to understand that you alone are going to be the one who's going to uplift you whenever you need it you got to be your own best friend your own cheerleader and you got to sit down there and to remind yourself of the worth and the power that you have inside of you because no one is going to make it happen for you baby you are the one who's going to make it fucking happen for you so if you don't believe it then who's gonna fucking believe it do you understand you are extremely powerful you know that you are so don't be afraid to sit down from time to time and just tell yourself that you are you feel me like who the fuck doesn't want to hear that they're that powerful everyone wants to hear that so tell it to yourself you don't need the outside validation all you need is you sit down on your bed on your couch and look in the mirror whatever the fuck you're doing even in your car but sit down and just be like babe i am the best i can do this i'm in control everything's fine and guess what that's completely right because it absolutely is stop worrying stop stressing it just is is what it is but you got the shit in the bag simply because you said so and that's it remind yourself when it's needed i promise you you won't regret it